Right now, nine Chicago area doctors are traveling 4,800 miles to the front lines in the war on Ukraine. They're bringing with them more than a half million dollars in medical supplies. CBS 2's Marissa Perlman was at O'Hare when they left and joins us now live. Good evening, Marissa. Yeah, good evening, Brad. Just moments ago, we watched as that group of Chicago area doctors took off from a very busy O'Hare airport tonight. By tomorrow afternoon, they will land in Poland and Ukraine. And all of these doctors tell us they're willing to risk their own lives to save those who are going through this crisis. 167 pieces of luggage stocked full of medical and surgical supplies and nine Chicago doctors. All flying to the front lines of the war in Ukraine. They'll spend five days in three Ukrainian hospitals and assessments in two cities in Poland, helping refugees who have now run for their lives. A lot of people sick, dehydrated. My heart is overwhelmed. The mission is personal for Dr. Irina Lelik. They'll be stopping in her hometown of Lviv and treating her own community. I never thought that I would use my skills in my home. Chicago area residents donated more than a half million dollars in supplies to this effort through Med Global, a nonprofit that responds to humanitarian crisis. And volunteers packed it all, along with some love notes to Ukraine in just five days. They just got together and made this happen. But the danger is real. Do you get nervous? Are you scared? 100%. 100%. <laughs> always, there's always that fear. A fear these doctors say they will have to overcome, with Russian forces now targeting hospitals, most recently in Mariupol. I believe, frankly, that if you intend to help people, God will protect you. Dr. Zahir Salul, MedGlobal co-founder, is no stranger to responding to war. And with his wife beside him, he knows he has a community back home rooting for his entire team. This time she said this is a huge crisis, you have to go. And do you worry about him when he's gone? Of course I do, but um, like, I, like he said, uh, God will always protect those who are the helpers. Now, most of these doctors will spend five days on the ground in Poland and Ukraine. One of the doctors, though, will stay behind for two weeks touring different hospitals across Ukraine and will be keeping tabs on his journey the entire time and will, of course, keep you posted. We're live at O'Hare Airport tonight. Marissa Perlman, CBS 2 News. Marissa, thank you.